Hello students how are you hope you all are doing good today in this video we will learn how to draw the beads so are you ready let's do it but before that let's do a quick revision as you can see this is my value bar so can you tell me in this where is the value bar yes this dark line this is your value bar very good as you know from number 1 to 9 we always draw on the ones rod as you know the meaning of t is for tens rod o is for ones rod so on which rod you will draw 1 to 9 yes on the ones rod very good this is one Can you see we have two rods on which rod I'm supposed to draw yes on the ones rod very good i hope you all remember what we are supposed to use to represent one on a backus lower bead and how we represent lower bead on the hand using our fingers as we have four finger we have four lower beads we cannot have more than four finger we cannot have more than four lower beads Very good. And what we used to represent the upper bead, a thumb. Yes, we have one thumb in a hand. We have one upper bead. As we cannot have more than one thumb, similarly we cannot have more than one upper bead. This is one. Let's make one on your hand. One. How many lower bead? Yes, one lower bead. So you will draw one lower bead on one rod. Let's do it. Just make sure your bead should touch the value bar. If your bead is not touching the value bar, then the value is zero. If you draw like this, as you can see, this is not touching the value bar, so the value is zero. So it's a wrong. We will not draw like this. we will not do any kind of shading in the beads like this this is not required okay we will not make very small beads not required we have lots of space we can easily utilize that space okay let's make two first make two on your hand one two so how many lower beads two lower beads very good let's draw them See my lower bead is touching the value bar and my second bead is touching the first bead very good you should not draw like this if this is you should not draw like this there should be no gap this is wrong okay let's make three make three on your hand first how many lower beads three lower beads so we will draw three lower beads here make sure it should touch the value bar Your number two bead should touch the number one bead. Yes, it's doing. And number three should touch the number two. You can cross check one, two, and three. Very good. Now let's make four on your hand first. Four, one, two, three, and four. Similarly, make four on your ones rod. Draw four beads here. One. Two, three, and four. Very good. Good work, class. Now make five. See, we are having only four fingers, not more than four fingers. So, here comes the magic of our backers. Do a thumbs up. Your thumb represents the upper bead. So, what it means? It means whenever you do a thumbs up or a, all the best, it means five in a backers. So you will draw one upper bead here. So it become five. Okay. Let's learn how to make six. So for that, first make five, five, six. So one upper bead and one lower bead. Let's make it five. And six, very good. 
Let me tell you, you all are doing very good. Let's make seven. Make five on your hand first. Five, six, seven. So, one upper beat and two lower beats. Let's make it here. One upper beat and two lower beat. Very good. Let's make it. So, how to do that? First, make five, six, seven, eight. So, one upper beat, three lower beat. Let's do it here also. One upper beat and three lower beat. You can also do the counting. Five, six, seven, eight. Very good. Just make sure. Don't leave any gap between the beads. Your bead should touch the value bar properly. Okay? Now, let's make nine. Make five first. Five, six, seven, eight and nine. So, one upper bead and four lower beads. Let's make here. Five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Don't you think it's easy or very easy peasy? Very easy. That's good. So, now you know how to draw one to nine. In the next video, we will learn how to draw from ten onwards. But still after watching the video, you are having any of the doubt? You can connect with me on WhatsApp. Thanks for watching. Keep practicing.